Hi everybody, I'm back with another video. And this video is about Wendy Williams and her ex, Kevin Hunter. Yesterday, um, Wendy Williams was out with her new thing, boo. She said she's just having fun. He's not a boyfriend. He's just having fun. And because a lot of people are talking, she said that Kevin had a whole baby on her from a woman that he's been busy with for 15 years. So she's just having fun, you know. Today, TMZ reports that Kevin says, yes, and about the show pony thing. He says she's just a show pony. But Kevin says he didn't make her a show pony. She was too lazy to go out. Um, I'm like, okay. She's too lazy to go out, so... I don't know about the lazy thing. Whether she was too lazy to go out. So he went out with Sharina for 15 years because she didn't want to go out. According to the article, Wendy Williams estranged husband Kevin Hunter Sr. says her claim he kept her pent up at home is a lie. So, I never heard Wendy say he kept her pen up at home. I never heard her say that. She said she was a show pony. So, exactly what is considered a show pony? I can imagine what it is, what I think it is. But knowing what the industry idea of a show pony is, I'm not so sure. He said she was too lazy to get. He said she was too lazy to give a D. But Wendy says, believe, but Wendy says, believe nothing, her ex say. So you say she's lazy and she didn't give a D about going out? About being pent up. I cannot imagine somebody being pent up for 20, let's say the 15 years she's seen with this girl. I can't imagine somebody being pent up all those years and just don't give a deal about nobody. You just, I can't imagine that. All you do is work and go home in your little pent up space. No friends, no nothing. That is not what I heard. And going back to when Nene was in the building when she was in, and I heard that Kevin and Nene's husband Greg got into a fight when they really said, and they said it was Nene and Wendy got into a fight, and Nene said she never met Wendy. So how Nene and Wendy get in a fight if Nene never met Wendy? But it was understood that Kevin... And Greg got into got into some kind of altercation. So, if Nene wasn't able to meet Wendy, who stopped it? Wendy basically just did just did what she was told. She was a show pony. I guess that's what that's what a show pony is. She was a show pony. She sees no one. She just out there for show. But. But she was making all the money and everybody was eating. Just like Nene says, she don't work, Greg don't eat. With that, if, ne if Wendy wasn't a show pony sitting out there making the millions, Kevin wouldn't eat. Little Kevin couldn't eat. Little Kevin wouldn't be, he wouldn't be in college. So, then it says, the way Kevin sees it, Wendy orchestrated her schedule and chose primarily to do her talk show and go home. 
I guess when you do the talk show, you go home, you're tired. But look at her now. She's on vacation, and she's doing stuff. She could have been doing that then. Why would she not want to go on vacation? They show Kevin on vacation with, uh, with Sharina, taking pictures with peace signs up and all of that. Why would do her show and go home? One thing I know about married couples, because I'm a married person, according to who you married to, you don't just get up and go out and have fun like Wendy's doing now, because the other spouse got a problem, basically. Just saying. A source close to Wendy is doubling. Okay, did I miss a point in there? Okay. We're told Kevin feels Wendy just didn't want to hit red carpet events or putting any effort outside of the camera work for her show. She don't want to be on the red carpet with Kevin. Nene is on the red carpet with Nene's on the red carpet with Greg, I guess, whatever red carpet they have. The only people not on the red carpet with a spouse, even if they're not getting along, are those that are not married. Or who don't have a significant other that they're living with or whatever, how they go. Just saying. A source close to Wendy is doubling down, though, calling Kevin ext extremely controlling. Exactly. And sneaky. Exactly. Doing the marriage and nothing he says is the truth. Now, controlling men, sneaky men, they don't want you doing nothing outside of what they have total control of. I don't know how when they did it. That's a missiveness will destroy your body. Yeah, you um, I can understand um, you know. Let me see, is my volume up? Yeah, I can see um, forgot my thought. It'll come back. Anyway, when it comes to business decision, sources close to Kevin says Wendy took a hands-off approach. And willingly left everything up to her husband, trusting him for 22 years to handle her career. Hands off, I can see, but pent up in a go to work on cameras and go home pent up, I can't see that. I'm seeing that's why it was um, um, girl named Tamar Braxton. I'm seeing that's why Tamar left Vince, who was her manager, who controlled everything. But what happened with that? She got tired of that. And she would say that the whole set will be set, practicing everything. She comes out the whole set different. For example, she went to do a concert. Everything is set. Her band is not there. She caught on to where the band is. The band says that Vince knew they weren't coming for whatever reason. If Vince is having a business, why does Tamar didn't have her band there and then get trolled by 50 Cent who took her band and said he have a band? You know, just make her look all crazy. Wendy and Tamar is two different people. Wendy just allow everything to be controlled or whatever. She come out there and whatever. Wendy was basically a robot is what I see. Tamar got, Tamar wasn't a robot. She might have was a show pointer for a bit, but she was never a robot. And it got to the place where the robot was like, you know, I ain't no robot. So she left. She wants to be in control. She wants to be herself. And at this point she is. Tamar Bracken is. Now let's get back to Wendy. This is her new friend. She says she's just out having fun. 
and I see nothing wrong with it. I ain't trying to start no video or just start that copyright thing for playing a video or anything, whatever. As for Wendy's young new arm candy, we're told Kevin isn't jealous and understands why she wants to go out and have something carefree fun. If that was the case, she would have been having some carefree fun the 22 years she was a show pony. Anyway, he does, however, take issue with Wendy saying he had a full baby with a woman. Did he not have a full baby with a woman? He was involved with for 15 years. We're told he calls that a gross exaggeration because he didn't meet his mistress until two. What I got to do, thou? What I got to do with anything? It does not matter that you did not meet her until 2008. That's irrelevant. It's been what? 11 years? You may not have met her in 2008. That might be what? If Wendy says 15 years, then somewhere in her mind, she saw her or knew of her or her following you or her trying to get with you four years before you met, or four years before you say you met. Either way it goes, women know before you know they know. Okay, moving on. We get the feeling the nitpicking is just beginning. And even though Wendy thinks they'll eventually make peace, it feels like their divorce is going to be long drawn out of here, more than likely, as all divorces are. But anyway, that's for this article. And I think it's crazy that he calls her lazy to go out. The fact that she's having so much fun now shows that she wasn't lazy to go out. Like he's, look at here, what he says about her schedule. I saw that, but I don't know if I read about it, read what he said about the schedule. Go back up. Start. No, don't start playing nothing. Where is he saying, where did he mention about her? She had her own schedule. I'm so sure I saw that. There you go. The way Kevin sees it, when they orchestrated her schedule, and she orchestrated her schedule. If so, she orchestrated her schedule. So, could she have orchestrated her schedule to include hanging out? Now, I know she said she didn't have any friends, and therefore... She didn't have that to worry about. But she had family. She could have been having dinner with her sister like she did after they um, separated. She had family. She could she could have gone on vacation with family. Instead of going on vacation with Kevin and sitting in the hotel while he hang out at the beach with Serena. That absolutely makes no sense. I understand controlling sneaky. I understand control is sneaky. Spouses. Because I'm married. And I'm not about being a robot. Because you know what? We got our own mind, our own mind, our own heart. I want to do what I want to do. I want to make my money. I don't got a problem. But you know, being respectful or whatever. But, I got to do me. I want to go on a cruise in a couple of months, next month, by myself. We got the spouse. I want to do things. Spouses don't allow stuff like that. Some spouses do. And I got a lot of friends and spouses that do. So, it is what it is. I, I just... Don't necessarily believe Wendy chose to be pent up 
for 22 years and have nothing but the four walls. That made absolutely no sense. You can find a lot to do in four walls and nobody and no friends. There's a lot you can do online. Because the majority of my time is spent online. And, you know, I can go out and, you know, and I don't have no friends because I'm kind of, I'm the weird kind. I don't have a lot of friends to hang out with. But I got friends that want to hang out with me now. But, you know, I'm on here all day. But anyway, being cooked up, pent up. That is not what a woman want to do. She's just lazy. But then again, if she's going out doing things with Kevin, and he's utterly annoying, totally annoying, making vacation funless, that may be why she don't, she didn't want to go on the red carpet to do things. But I'm, I'm pretty sure she'll probably be going on the red carpet now. Do a lot of things she hadn't done in 21 years. Yes. Go, Wendy. It is what it is. That is it for this video. And I will see you on the next video. Bye.